Surprise! I'm still here. I just had to look at my old videos to even see when the last time I was here, and it was August the 15th. So, my name is Jennifer. I had gastric bypass surgery on August the 23rd, 2017. Um, highest weight that I know of was 328 pounds back in June 2016. I had um, surgery, like I said, gastric bypass surgery. Um, it went in at 229.8 pounds, so I lost 100 pounds on my own before surgery. Um, trying to think. Um, I want. It was August 15th. I came to you at 164 point something this week. Um, I am not sure what week this is. It'll be in the description box. Um, but um, I am now 170.4 as of this morning. So yes, I've had an increase, which is kind of why I've been MIA. Um, so you've missed my one year anniversary from surgery. Um, I gotten a tattoo. Um, I did get it. It's on my upper thigh. I can't show you because I'm wearing pants and yeah, just, I ain't pulling my pants down at work. <laughs> and of course, I've got my hair done, got my makeup on. Um, not much has changed, guys. That's kind of why I've not come to you. Getting kind of boring saying the same thing over and over. Um, sticking to the same foods, foods I shouldn't have. Um, trying to think I'm not sure if I mentioned I was having um, partial knee replacement um, that's coming up on the 23rd of October yeah of October um, so yes I'm getting a partial knee replacement thank the Lord that's coming up soon um, and kind of another reason why I've really not been doing videos is because a lot of you are friends with me on Instagram and or Facebook so if you know what's going on you usually see it there and I know some of you aren't friends with me on those platforms so you're probably wondering where the heck is Jennifer I'm still living <laughs> um, but the main reason I was coming to you was I was tagged in two videos from smaller in NC Jamie um, there was two different ones and one was 21 questions and one was 20 questions but I just put it all together and I came up with what was it 35 I believe 36 questions because um, a couple of them were double questions so I didn't want to have to double them so this um, is um, get to know me tag from her um, if you've not heard of her she's somewhat new-ish out of um, her surgery and um, she's got a good channel um, she's a good friend so you should go find her again it's smaller in NC NC standing for um, North Carolina and um, her name's Jamie so this is the tag I was tagged in I'm gonna try not to hold my papers down so I'm not looking down at them um, question one What's my middle name? It's Lynn. Um, number two, favorite subject in school? Um, environmental science, science, biology, that kind of stuff. Um, I did go to a um, tech school and it was landscaping and horticulture. Um, I liked more the flower arrangement part of that, not so much the landscaping part of that because I didn't know how to say the names of the trees, their technical names. I knew them as maples, birches, whatever we have here in Michigan, not their um, foreign names. I can't even remember what other language it was. But anyhow, I them were that's the subjects I liked in school. Off subject. Favorite um, number three. Favorite drinks. Um, I don't have any favorite adult beverages because I have an allergic reaction to alcohol. But if I want a drink, which I haven't had in a long time, would be, um, oh, see, it's been so long ago, I don't remember. Um, I 
know it's tequila. Um, it's a more expensive tequila. It'll come to me when I don't need it. But as far as an adult beverage, it would be tequila. Um, and non-alcoholic drinks would be coffee, whether it's decaf or regular, and tea, whether it's hot or cold. Um, favorite color, I like all shades of pinks, all shades of purples. Favorite animal, I don't have just one. I love them all. The only ones I don't like are multi-legged things like millipedes and centipedes and fast-moving cockroaches. <laughs> Anything with lots of legs. I'm okay with spiders and most insects, but millipedes and centipedes, they give me the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> it freaks me out just thinking about it. All those little legs moving. <laughs> Anyhow, um, have I traveled out of the U.S.? Yes, I've been to Canada three different times, whether it was on, I live in Michigan, so whether it was on my way to New York, we would cut through Canada. Um, I've seen Canada on the Niagara Falls part, and when I went up to the Sioux Locks up in the Upper Peninsula, went to Canada up there. I think that's, yeah, them are the only times that I've been to Canada. Um, favorite perfume, I'm totally gonna slander these, I'm sure. Armani, that's one of them I like. And Mueller, I'm gonna assume the G is silent, but it's M-U-G-L-E-R, Mueller, Mueller, Terry is the person's name. And they make three scents. One's Alien, one's Angel, and one's Aura. Um, the Aura is a new one, but they are my favorite smells. Number eight, my biggest fear. In no particular order, I fear losing my mother, um, whether it be in passing or, yeah, passing, I guess that's what I mean. Um, we've made an agreement that she won't pass before me and I won't pass before her. So we have to pass together. <laughs> um, my kids and my husband, those are my fears. Um, in the dark, I don't like the dark. Um, favorite foods, um, I don't have a favorite, but anything off the breakfast and the taco. Those are two favorite foods that I would choose when going out to eat, whether it be taco or breakfast food. Um, do I have a hobby? If sleeping is considered a hobby, I love that. <laughs> um, I used to scrapbook, but when cell phones became popular, my camera was used less, so I didn't take pictures as much. So scrapbook has kind of went wayside. Um, favorite candle scent? Um, fall and winter smells are my favorite, so more the cinnamon... Um, pumpkin, them type of smells are my favorite smells. Um, are you a good cook? Well, I've not killed anybody with my cooking, so I must be okay. <laughs> but I don't think I'm a good cook. Um, do I have a garden? Nope, I don't have a green thumb. Um, do you have tattoos? I've got 26 of them. Um, starting from behind my ear all the way down to my feet. Um, front side, back side, arms, I have them everywhere. Um, most embarrassing moment. This is TMI and this is about BMs. So before weight loss surgery, I was on a medicine called metformin for diabetes and I couldn't eat high fatty food Sorry, I was crooked. Fatty foods, or they would go right through me. So my two most embarrassing moments would be when we would go have Chinese food at our mall, and probably within five minutes, I needed to find a bathroom, or I was going to have an accident, and a few times I had. Um, and another time, same scenario. I don't know what I had. We were up at a place with my folks um, doing senior pictures for my son, and this area we were at 
is a one-way direction type of thing. You go in, you go back out. I had to go the wrong way to race to the bathroom in my car. I was going to have an accident. Thank goodness I didn't, but it was so embarrassing. Um, so yeah, those are my embarrassing moments. I had to get off that medicine. I told my doctor I was not going to take it. And yeah, I hated that because there'd be times it would be traveling on the road. When the BM happens, it just happened fast. <laughs> um, number 16, Harry Potter, Twilight, or Hunger Games. Which movie do I like the best? Well, when Harry Potter came out, I was part of a religion that frowned upon witchcraft of like Harry Potter um, wizardry stuff. So I never got to see that. Um, don't interest me. Not because of religious reasons, no. Um, Hunger Games, I've heard of it, never seen it. As far as Twilight, I watched the first one. It was okay too teeny for me. Um, I like werewolf type movies, but more adult type because I'm a fan of the underworld. So I do like werewolves and vampires, just in adult form, not teen versions. <laughs> um, number 17, who would, what female celebrity would I want for a sister? I love my sister, so I wouldn't want one, but if I had to choose one, it'd be, I think I, I'll say her name, Charlize Theron, only because she's hot. I know that'd be weird thinking my sister was hot. If I were to choose one, it'd be her. <laughs> um, number 18, favorite tea. Um, chamomile, I bought at a local powwow. That was really good. So it was like um, freshly grown chamomile. Um, mint of any type. And this is going to sound odd. And I'm not sure where it grows. I would assume all over. Um, wintergreen that grows wild. Um, grows in the woods um, with little red berries. I like to pick those and brew those. So that's good. So it's a, it's a mint, wintergreen type. Um, evergreen? Is it evergreen? Wintergreen? I don't know. They're little green leaves with, and they grow little red berries. Um, can um, What kind of car do I drive? Betsy is her name and she's a 2001 Buick LeSabre. Yeah, she's an old beast, <laughs> but I love her. <laughs> um, first concert that I've been to, do not laugh, please. It was Winona Judd. <laughs> yeah, country. But aside from her, <laughs> I've been to about 30 other concerts that are underground rap music. Um, I've not been to a concert in like four years. I'm kind of having withdrawals. I'm hoping Halloween I can go to one. No, because my surgery. I just remembered. Boo. I haven't been to a concert in forever because I just can't stand for that long. <laughs> Anyhow, first concert, Winona Judd. If you don't know the group Judds back in the 80s and 90s. Not the mother, the daughter. Um, favorite smells. I like fall smells. Um, lawn, clean laundry smells. And this is going to sound strange, but the smell of leaves in the fall, like actual leaves, um, it just reminds me of when I was a kid playing in the leaf piles. So there's times I'll go in the woods just to sit in the woods and smell. Yeah, um, 22, a dream job. Um, my first dream job would be working in a um, either retirement home, old folks home, um, things of that nature, just to be able to help the elderly. Um, why don't I? Because usually they're there to pass away and I would be affected by that. I would get an attachment 
as I do to almost anything and everybody. Um, so it would affect me with their passing. Um, another dream job would I would love to work in a national park like Yosemite National Park and do research on the wildlife. Um, I remember as a kid I always wanted to be a DNR but I was afraid to be bitten by a rabid animal. <laughs> so I never did that. Um, number 23, favorite footwear. If I ain't barefoot it's probably slip on shoes. I hate shoes. I hate socks. Um, jeans or shorts. I prefer jeans. Um, beach or mountain. I prefer mountain. I like the sound of the beach, but I feel like a whale on the beach. And I fry because I'm a ginger. <laughs> so mountains, 100%. Favorite holiday. Christmas and not because of religious reasons. I just like to give gifts. So I enjoy giving people things um, and my anniversary. Um, piercings. Um, I have four. I got two here and two here. But in the past, you probably can't see the scar. I've had two different piercings. They're called microdermal. Um, I've had two different ones here. Yeah, one right on top of each other. I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see the scars. The first one, um, hopefully you're not squeamish and it didn't like hurt and it wasn't disgusting, but I had a dog jump on my chest and its long fur got hooked on it and it pulled. Just that little bit of pull made the piercing sit crooked instead of flat. Um, it's just a sensitive area that they can get snagged on. Um, that one healed up for a long time and then um, I got another one at a different time in my seat belt where it was sitting right here kind of curls over instead of lays flat well it snagged it again didn't rip it out but it the little footing that goes under your skin was popped out so it was like on an angle and I was just afraid of it catching all the time so I had him just take it out and I gave up um, I've had my eyebrow done. I've had a lip done. I had, uh, I think it's called an industrial bar. It's those long bars on your ear. I had one of those and it caused a huge growth on my ear, which I've since cut off. It got to be about the size of my thumb, the top of my thumb. And it was just going to keep growing. Um, some kind of cyst. I don't know. Um, I guess it's pretty common from what my surgeon said that removed it. It's pretty common from piercings. Um, what else? I've had my tongue done twice. I would say out of all my piercings that was the worst because my tongue rejected the metal and I couldn't eat. Obviously your tongue swells up. Excuse me. And it was just hard to eat. Anyhow, current piercings. I just got four in my ears. Um, do I like to cook? If baking is one of them, yeah. I like to bake. I'm not so much of a cooker. Um, favorite vegetable? Carrots are my favorite. Do I wear glasses? Nope. I don't wear contacts. Knock on wood. My eyes are good. Um, favorite season? Summer would be my favorite now because it's nice and warm. And fall? I like fall because of the color and the fashion of fall because I like to wear layers. Um, I don't like what comes next after fall. Um, dream travel. If you know me, you know New Mexico is my favorite place to travel to. I've been there four times. Um, it was 2016 since I've been there. Long story. Um, and probably another dream getaway would be Africa to go on a real life safari. That would be fun. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be eaten, but I'd like to be on a safari. Um, favorite fruit? I would say my first would be dragon fruit. I have not had it since before surgery, so I don't know if I like it anymore or if it's too sweet. If you've not had dragon fruit, it's a mix between a strawberry and a kiwi. It's got little seeds in it like a kiwi has in it, but it's sweet like a strawberry. Um, apples? Um, are my second favorite, which sadly, the ones I like, 
I find too sweet, which are the Fiji's and Gallia's. Those are my favorite, but now they're too sweet, so I can't eat as much. Um, banana is my third, and blueberries are my fourth. Um, old jobs. What old jobs have I had? Um, <laughs> I've had many hats. <laughs> so I've been um, a cashier at places. I've worked in a few factories. I've worked at hotels. I've done housekeeping a lot. I've worked at a house hospital. Um, I'm working at a spa. I work at a grocery store. I've worked at a dog daycare. So yeah, I've had lots of jobs. Um, do I own pets? Yes, I own two dogs, which are Chinese Cresteds. If you don't know what they are, they're hairless, semi-hairless dogs. They are brothers, Tango and Rico. I own a pure white cat um, with one blue eye, one green eye, and come to find out he's a van cat, like V-A-N. He's his own breed. I assumed he was part Siamese because of the blue eye, but him being them two color eyes in white, he's a van cat. Um, he was a rescue where we did buy our dogs. Um, and we have two birds, which are zebra finches, um, two females. Um, I think, yeah. Um, and the last one, number 36, favorite treats. I have lots of them, but my favorite would be banana bread. Um, and um, homemade bread or homemade biscuits. I'm fine. I can stay out of the bread, like the store bought bread, but if you give me a homemade biscuit and a homemade bread, I'm wondering if it's the yeast. Because if I eat a homemade biscuit, that's the first thing I'm tasting and I'm like, in heaven. <laughs> Anyhow, this has been almost 23 minutes. Um, this is a get to know me tag, again, from Jamie. Um, see who I can tag. I know um, Michelle from Hello VSG 2016. I know she's been tagged. Um, how about Ange R and Y? I'll tag you. I will tag. Hmm. How about if I just tag whoever watches this? Because I have quite a few followers and off the top of my head, I can't remember who you all are. And I know I have some newbies. Um, so yeah, if you're seeing this, I tag you and tag me back. No, I guess you can't tag me back. But I'd like to know. I'd like to know all about you more. All right, everybody. Have a great week. And I promise I'll do more updates. I was just waiting for more things to happen in my life. And with my knee surgery coming up soon in 34 days, I'm sure I'll have more time on my hands. Because I'll be off work for three months at the least. So this girl's going to be bored. So we'll talk to you later, guys. Hope you didn't miss me too much.